Do you make a lot of spelling mistakes? Do you have difficulty remembering the correct spellings of words? Well, in this lesson, I'm going to teach you an easy three-step method to improve your spelling and write correctly without making mistakes. So let's talk about that. Okay, the first step of this exercise is to find your spelling mistakes. You do this by checking your own writing. If you are a student, then I'm sure you write a lot. If you work, you might write emails or reports. So at least once per week, take your writing and try to find spelling mistakes that you have made. Now, I know that this can be difficult. You don't know what mistakes you're making. So there are two great ways to know your mistakes. The first is to ask someone else to read your work and underline or circle any errors and also give you the correct spellings. The second option is to take your writing and type it or copy paste it into Microsoft Word. The software will then underline your spelling mistakes for you and give you the corrections. This way you can identify your own errors. Okay, let's do an exercise to understand this process. Here's a short text that I wrote. There are five spelling errors in it. Stop the video, try to find the mistakes, then play the video again and check. Okay, here are the answers. A lot should be spelled with a space. Definitely has no A. It should be an I. Received is written with EI, not IE. Rhythm needs to have an H after R. And schedule needs to start with SCH. Okay, did you find them all? All right, so like this, you identify the words that you are spelling incorrectly and learn their correct spellings. And now comes the important part. Record the correct spellings of these words. That means you should note down the correct spellings of all the words you spelled wrongly in a notebook or in a file on your computer. You should write the spellings on one side of the page and on the other you should write the phonetic transcription. That is the same word in pronunciation symbols.